Green Left Weekly is an Australian socialist newspaper, written by progressive activists to "...present the views excluded by the big business media." The newspaper was founded in 1990, maintaining close ties to the Socialist Alliance. Green Left Weekly's 20th anniversary issue was published in February 2011, and in March 2014, had its 1000th edition issued, making the newspaper the longest running explicitly left wing publication in the country. Overview It is an independent Australian source of local, national and international news, and provides left-wing analysis and debate to strengthen the anti-capitalist and socialist movements. In an editorial in the first issue, Green Left Weekly stated, Subjects of particular importance to Green Left Weekly include workers' rights, refugees, women's rights, global warming, environmental destruction, Australian Aboriginal land rights, and foreign policy, especially Australia's military intervention in the Asia Pacific region, the US led invasions of Afghanistan and Iraq, and other forms of US political intervention overseas, such as in Latin America. In 2011, Green Left Weekly was investigated by the Australian Competition and Consumer Commission at the request of the Bailiu Ministry for supporting boycott, divestment and sanctions actions in Melbourne. The movement was found not to have violated any laws. The newspaper strongly supports the socialist policy of Bolivia and Ecuador and the Bolivarian Revolution in Venezuela led by Hugo Chavez, and in the past opened a bureau in Caracas to improve its coverage of events there. At the time, it was the only Australian newspaper with a bureau in Latin America. It is also the only Australian newspaper to regularly print articles by left wing journalist John Pilger. Pilger has said of Green Left Weekly, There are few other newspapers radical or any other kind that draw together news and analysis that is as well informed, credible, and non-sectarian as Green Left Weekly. Its work has influenced mine and has been a beacon to those who believe the press ought to be an agent of the people." Since 2008, Green Left Weekly has published a monthly Arabic language supplement, The Flame, edited by Socialist Alliance members of the growing Sudanese Australian community. In 2009, Green Left Weekly launched a new Spanish language supplement, Foro Social Latinoamericano, edited by the Latin America Social Forum in Sydney, a collaboration between left wing members and groups in the Latin American community in Australia. <laughs> Awards In June 2005 Green Left Weekly won an award from web surveying company Hitwise. Hitwise ranked the website as the most popular Australian-based political site. Green Left Weekly received a similar award in 2006, and in the period between June and December 2009, Green Left Weekly once again ranked in the top 10, achieving 7th position. Topic. Criticism Green Left Weekly is routinely criticized by News Limited publications including editorials and opinion pieces in the Australian, in particular accusing Green Left Weekly of supporting terrorism and anti-Semitism for their criticism of Israel. Topic. See also List of newspapers in Australia